And I guess my point to anybody that wants to come and work and be part of Coventry's future, there will be opportunities for you to be able to, to be innovative, to be able to bring your own style, not hampered or fettered by anything. We're not bureaucratic. We want people's talent, creativity to come to the fore. So we want the best. And why shouldn't we have it? We're one of the most aspirational, fastest growing cities in the country. So for me, one of the big, big challenges, but also opportunities for us as a, as a city is about how we ensure once and for all that we find a way every single day to put the community voice the asset that is our people and our communities are the heart of everything that we design, that we do. And guess what? We're not gonna do it at them. We're not gonna do it for them. We're gonna do it with them. And I want people to be able to be part of that journey. Here is a city that has got absolutely everything going for it. Practically, got an ability to access the housing market in ways that aren't possible elsewhere in the country, certainly in London and the southeast. We've got some amazing green spaces, uh, but we've also got an attitude which is about we know that we can, as a city, grow even more, become even more prosperous. At the heart of a city is its people. The people that have made it, the people that are here today, and the people that are going to make it tomorrow as well. Let's be really clear that the kind of DNA that I'm expecting of people are those that are creative, they're innovative, they have energy, they have a kind of thirst for making a difference to people's lives and, in fact, the place of Coventry. We celebrate diversity, we celebrate creativity, but the place wants people to come and express themselves. So we expect, and for the people of Coventry, we should have the best. We don't want second best, we want absolutely the best.